In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to add or remove the little comment form that appears beneath your pages and posts in WordPress. This is a WordPress page that you're looking at here, and this is on our sample site, our demo site. What you'll see is this little leave a reply box. Now, on a lot of WordPress pages and posts, you can leave a trail of replies so people can start a conversation based on your blog post or your page. What WordPress does is, out of the box, it comes with these comment fields on the pages, on each of your WordPress pages, and often you won't want these to appear on your pages, maybe just on your blog posts, because for different reasons you might not want people to leave comments on your pages. It might be just sort of a one-way street where you want to communicate a message to the people reading the content on your site rather than them giving you feedback, for example. It's actually very simple to remove these, but sometimes people struggle a little bit with how to do it because the ability to remove and add these is a little bit hidden. You can actually do it individually on each page, and this is how it's done. So if you go to the page or post editor, we're going to go to page editor for this sample, you'll see what the text looks like on the page right here. Um, if you scroll around, you'll notice it's a little bit difficult to figure out how to remove this comment field. It doesn't seem like it actually exists anywhere and there's no window for it. Fortunately, I'm here to show you how to do it. If you navigate up to this little tab here that says Screen Options and click, you'll see a whole new list of options appear. Now these might be different on your site depending on what theme you have installed. Every WordPress theme and plugin offers different options up here. And this is sort of hidden and out of view to minimize the clutter on the post and page editor window. What you'll want to do is go to the Discussion tab right here. Check this box. And what that'll do is it'll open another box beneath all of these other boxes. So if you scroll down, and here it is. Yours might be not quite this far down. I have a lot of different boxes and windows here with different options on the company site. Um, you'll see two different check marks. One of them says allow comments and the other says allow trackbacks and pingbacks. The one that controls the comment form is the allow comments box. So if you uncheck this, this will remove the entire comments field and not allow people to post comments on your WordPress page or post. Now, allow trackbacks and pingbacks is something else. That is actually an option that allows people to leave feedback on whether or not they've linked to your site. And it will actually show up as a pingback on your page where the comments are if you leave that checked. So it will say, for example, this article linked to your post on this date by this author. Um, let's remove both of those for now. And for pages, you may or may not want to remove the pingbacks or trackbacks. That's something that you can come to on your own. So if we remove both of these and scroll back up, and hit the blue update button. And then we'll go to our site and reload the page. And you'll notice the comment field is now gone. You can easily put it back, of course, too, by just reversing the steps you made earlier. Now, the discussion form or box is actually already open. We don't need to actually scroll up here and recheck this because it's already checked. This just, once again, adds or removes different boxes than under the Screen Options tab. So we'll scroll back down, let's put our comment field back, our pings backs and track backs back, hit update. And just like that, it's back and people can leave comments once again.